this following video, if you are struggling to choose between a bully kuda, also known as the beast from the east and a Neapolitan mastiff, also known as Mastino Napolitano in Italy, we have compiled all the detailed information you need to know to help you make the best choice. So let's begin the fight. Intimidation Factor A bully kuda has a fearsome reputation, one that is well deserved. An adult male bully kuda stands at an impressive height of 28 to 36 inches at the withers, and weighs between 70 to 90 kilograms. They are enormous aggressive and dangerous fighting dogs. They are popular amongst young men who want to project a macho image, whereas the Neapolitan Mastiffs are among the biggest dog breeds in the world. An adult male Mastino stands at an impressive height of 26 to 31 inches at the withers, and weighs between 50 to 90 kilograms. They are a giant dog and boast having a tremendous amount of loose skin around their faces and necks. Their heads are large with dogs boasting a broad skull and a well-defined stop. However, in terms of intimidation, the bully Kuda have got all the hallmarks of an intimidating breed as compared to a Mastino. So one point to bully Kuda. Bully Kuda 1 Mastino 0, powerful and loudest bark. Let's hear it first and we'll decide accordingly. In our opinion a bully kuda has a powerful bark. So one point to bully kuda. Bully kuda 2 Mastino 0, bite force. In case of both the dogs, we didn't have any information with respect to their bite force. However in our opinion, considering the dog breeds with similar cranial dimensions, we estimate it could be in between 500 to 700 psi. But with no concrete data available to compare. One point to both. Bully Kuda 3 Mastino 1 Temperament The Bully Kuda has a reputation of being an intelligent noble dog, with aggressive and protective temperament. They can be a dangerous breed if not controlled and raised right. They need a strong willed owner whom they can respect, otherwise they can be dominating and very territorial. Whereas a Mastino may also be imposing to look at, but they are gentle giants with even temper and docile nature as compared to a Bully Kuda. So one point to Mastino. Bully Kuda 3 Mastino 2 Lifespan Both the dogs have similar life expectancy of 8 to 10 years. So one point to both. Bully Kuda 4 Mastino 3 Exercise and Energy Levels The Bully Kudas are high maintenance dogs in the exercise department, and they ideally need to be taken out for a walk, a minimum of twice a day for a good hour each time, whereas the Mastinos have moderate exercise needs. A state walk is more than enough to satisfy their exercise needs. So with higher energy levels, one point to Bully Kuda. Bully Kuda 5 Mastino 3. Friendly with kids and other pets. Both the breeds are known to be good around children's, more especially if they are well bred, even tempered dogs. In case of other dogs and pets, both the dogs can show aggression which is why it's important they be introduced to each other slowly and carefully to make sure things go smoothly. So one point to both. Bully Kuda 6 Mastino 4. Powerful guard dog. In our opinion, a Bully Kuda is extremely ferocious and a powerful guard dog as compared to a Mastino. So one point to Bully Kuda. Bully Kuda 7 Mastino 4. So the winner between the two giants is the beast from the east, Bully Kuda.